Hi guys, welcome back to the Scrappery. Today's video is a layout using Ruben, which is the September Scrappery kit. So I was super excited to finally get to play with some Crepe Paper Wonder. I love this collection. It's one of my favorite collections out at the moment. So I was super excited to finally get to play with that. So I started off by adding some splatters to some white cardstock, as you can see here. I think most of them are Heidi Swap Color Shine Bar 1, which is a Mr. Huey's ink, I think. Ooh, that rhymes. <laughs> um, and I just pre-cut some pattern paper for layers behind my photo, which I'll put together in a minute. That Aztec one right there is my favourite piece in the whole collection. I love that. I think it has me written all over it. Not literally, but um, yeah, I just love the print and the colours. And I also really love that floral piece. They're my two favourites in the Wonder collection. And I they go together really nicely as well. So... I definitely want to use them on this layout and I'll probably use them on every other layout too um, that I create with this kit. Um, and so I just put together a little uh, ephemera cluster, I guess you would call it, with the ephemera, crepe paper ephemera, which is in the kit, obviously. I love this ephemera because it's like really thick. I don't know if it's thicker than normal ephemera because I feel like it is. Otherwise, I probably wouldn't have noticed. But I noticed it was really, like, the thickness of it. So, yeah. Um, and I just added some washi tape from my stash. It's not really washi tape. It's more like a um, like a masking. I don't know. It's hard to describe. But that one is from Typo. And it's just a peach with a white dot. And I just added a small strip of the washi tape that's in the bits and pieces kit, I think. It's in one of the kits. I'm pretty sure it's a bits and pieces kit. Yes. Um, it's just a little XO, I think. XO, XO, XO. Um, so I added that on too. And yeah, I also put a doily behind my photo. That is, that's one from the store. Um, it comes in the pack with all the colours. Um, but none of the colours really went with this layout, so I just used the white one. And I love these puffy stickers. These are the best thing ever. Um, and they smell like pool toys. Is that weird that I think that? Um, but they smell, they like smell like plastic rubber. Yeah. Um, but they are so fun. They're so squishy. And yeah. They just look so cute. I think they're adorable. Um, definitely a great addition to the kit. Um, definitely. Um, and those if enamel dots I love as well. Love the colours of those. I think they were in the kit before this one. But there was only a few. And I was really sad. Um, there's like one of each colour. But um, in this one you get a few of each colour which is really nice. Um, and some sequins as well. They're like... These sequins are great because they um have like adhesive on the back already, so you just peel them off and stick them down, and you're all good to go. Um, pulling tape off the back of mounted tape is like the worst. Um, <laughs> so I think I did most of that off camera, but um, yeah, now I'm just sticking down my little cluster. This layout isn't very girly. I probably could have added some more flowers somewhere, but the kit is very unisex, so there isn't much feminine things in it. It's very neutral, as is the range. It's designed to use photos of your kids in it, so I used this photo of my cousin Anna, which I hadn't scrapped any of these photos I took for them last year, I think, so... I thought I would take this opportunity and use this range to do that. Um, and I really like this photo too. I think it's very cute. So now I am just adding some more enamel dots, I think. With my embellishments and everything, I went for 
a confetti look. That's what I am coining it. Um, instead of in, like clustering my little embellishments and f like finishing touches, I kind of just scattered them around. Um, yeah, instead of clustering, I confettied them, which um, yeah, I'm starting a thing. Um, so I just put that five down. That is from the Maggie Holmes chipboard pack in the bits and pieces kit and the colors went really well. So I had to use that and she's five. So yeah. Um, and I did end up adding those little, that floral puffy thing there, which is so cute. I love it. Um, so yeah. So I think this layout is close to finish. It was a very quick layout. As you can see, it's only seven minutes this video goes for. And I'm sorry about the lighting too. It was just the sun was almost gone and the lighting, the natural light wasn't so great. So I had to pull some lights in. But you get the gist of it. Um, and the, yeah, the colors are a bit nicer in real life. But I think that is it. So that is the finished product. Sorry, I don't have any photos for you. Um, thank you for watching. Please subscribe and like and do all that good stuff. And I will talk to you guys next time. Bye.